This beautiful early spring weather may have many of you yearning for summer and bathing suit season. And since our abs can be the most difficult muscles to tone, personal trainer Allie McWilliams is in today to demonstrate some great plank variations in our Friday fitness segment. So good to have you in. I want you to explain again why planks are so effective. Super efficient. Um, super effective and then what's also really great is that you don't have to buy a gym membership or you don't have to buy any toys so there's no excuses you can do them anywhere at any time in fact you can do them right yes. now while you're watching and just give yourself a try for the next three minutes and see how it goes okay so a few months ago we shared five ideas and you have yep. five new variations tonight we're going to start with the moving plank yes so this one is actually a little more advanced so if you're new to this you might want to work up to it so again when you're into that plank position you lock out your arms are strong you pull your belly button in seam your rib cage together squeeze your glutes you're going to move so i'm going to come towards lee okay so if you have tons of room and then you're going to pause you could keep going step and over and you're wanting to watch to make sure that this line is nice and straight and your butt's not up or right sinking. you're not here yep. and you're not sagging so it's nice and strong and if you want you could throw a push-up in Ooh, that's you know, a good idea end, so if you wanted to add more you could add that push-up I hope so. everyone at home is doing this right now, <laughs> probably already breathing heavily. Okay, the second option is the opposite elbow knee tuck. Right, so you're just going to take your left knee into your right elbow. So, so your again, obliques. Yes, big time obliques, and you're really going to hit the rectus. Actually, you're working all four of those um, ab areas, so you're just tucking that knee in, nice and strong arms. Show us the next one, the spider plank. This is knee to elbow. So same side. So that left knee goes to that left elbow. So a little more obliques here. Okay. And you have to make sure you have a nice strong back and core to be doing this. Correct. These and moves. if you needed to, you could come down onto your knees or you could do them on your elbows if you have wrist issues. Okay. The next number four, we have opposite arm and leg raise. So this is going to be great. So if you're starting out, especially, you want to start here. So abs are in tight. Try to keep those hips straight. You're going to just hold it for about six or seven seconds and then you're going to switch. So again, you can take that up onto your hands and your toes to make it a lot harder, but watch your hips. I want to get the last one in. We've got a couple seconds left, Allie, the T plank. So again, you're just into regular plank. You're totally locked out. You're going to turn into those side planks, pause for a moment, come back into that plank, take it over to the other side, pause. Nice job. Back. So there you go, five different options to do planks, gets your abs, and really, a really good whole body workout yes, there. Does. Allie, thank you. If you'd like to chat with her about planks or have other exercise-related questions, we'll connect you to our website on news links.